Oh, yeah. I'm loving this weather. It's nice out. It's only like plus four or something. It'll probably get warmer in the next hour. So like regular t-shirt and t-shirt, t-shirt and shorts, and I'm I'm good. I'm good to go. Um, gonna head out to six mile today. First uh, first six mile ride of the season. It rained a little last night, so I'm kind of concerned. Um, I didn't notice the rain over here. Someone on the west side said it rained, so. Hopefully six mile didn't really get it <laughs> if it did it's gonna be muddy and it's gonna be a mess and a disaster So uh, stay tuned for that I guess but yeah heading up six mile uh, first time of the season and uh, gonna have some fun with it Another reason I should have the GoPro on all the time. That was really funny. The dude on the uh, on the bike next to me. He pulled up and he looked at me. He's like, "Want to race?" <laughs> uh, dad jokes, I guess. <clears throat> but it would be useful to have the GoPro on at all times for sure. I uh, I generally only start it now on the way to a tr like when I'm on the trail or about to start the trail. <clears throat> because you know battery life <clears throat> and less editing but I mean I wouldn't worry about the editing so much if uh, the battery life was better but it's it's not so <laughs> oh well I stopped to lower my seat here and uh, give you a little bit of the view before we start moving I'm gonna be heading down K2 into six mile and then I don't remember the name of the other trail that it links to uh, before we head to the island. I want to head to the island and, and see how wet it is. It's probably going to be too muddy to, to cross over today. Um, but we'll talk about that when we get there. We'll see the situation. But yeah, I just love this view, just going into the trail. But yeah, let's, let's head it.
seem too easy. <laughs> well, halfway to nailing this bit. Okay. Whew. Couple things. I uh, forgot to kind of state my goals on this ride, but this was honestly not one of the goals I had uh, this time around. Not like realistically, because I've never been able to just ride up there. Uh, part of it's a mental game, as you can kind of see here on the edge of a cliff, and it's rocky, but also, it always creeps up on me because my trail vision is not great. So I'm going over there, I'm looking at this kind of uphill section, and then right about here at that crest here is where I notice, oh crap, I got this rock feature that I that I forgot about. And then, well early on I caught a pedal there too, and I was like, oh definitely not gonna do it now. But uh, as I got closer, I felt in control and just kind of went for it. And then, <laughs> I. <laughs> I haven't ridden this trail for, for months, so I kind of forgot what was after that. And as soon as I, I get up here, I would have to slow down, but I slowed down too much. And uh, there's this tasty little rock section here. And I mean, you can get your, your front tire around it, but after that my back tire is hitting something probably. I've never ridden over it really, because usually I've got to get off my bike in order to just get up here but let's enjoy the view for a bit while we're here it's gorgeous i would be sick to just like picnic up here or something i just love the sound of running water there it's so peaceful just a slight breeze birds chirping Even when the hills are dead, the coolies need rain, they need water. But uh, despite that, oh, it's just beautiful out here. Well, let's hop on the bike and make like a tree and get out of here.
down on that one to stabilize myself. I got into that right track right off the bat. Big mistake. to uh, an island. We're gonna have to pretty much ride to the island before, before we can see if we can cross it. Because we can get on it, I'm almost no problem. Getting off it is always the problem to get onto that next section, which uh, is double bogey. It's uh, right near a golf course. And it really links, like, you can ride all the way from where we started, all the way to Pavan. I haven't quite, I know how to get to the gun range. After that, I'm not sure how to link it to Pavan. Uh, um, I did it one time with a friend who was down here, who was like, part of the major region I actually started mountain biking in the first place. Uh, did it with him once where we came all the way from here hit up the the link went through double bogey to uh, kind of the Helen Schuler Center Northwoods River Run uh, then we did this other thing that it was like the first time I ever did it I don't know I'd like to go experiment with that again for sure uh, not today though <laughs> I don't I think that was a 30k ride that day and the end of it I was exhausted not just because the kilometers but because we climbed this huge whoop, huge uh, coulee and I was just like no like climbed like had to get off our bikes and walk it up and it was incredibly steep it was not fun it's way harder to climb up with a bike it's easy like if you had to go down well I shouldn't say it's easy it's easier to go down something with a bike than up because you can use the brakes to help you out if it's really steep and you're worried about falling but anyway it was rough yes yeah, so we've got no problem getting on the island Ooh. we'll see about getting off though
Nope. Man. That sucks. Sucks some real gaunch. Okay, settle down. Settle, buds. Well, even if the log was where it used to be, which, I mean, we can get it there. Even if it was there, uh, it's way too muddy, man. I would need, like, galoshes. Kind of annoying that other guy didn't say anything. I doubt he crossed. Maybe he did. Maybe he's hardcore parkour. But, uh, yeah, way too muddy for me. Not doing it. Not today. Wait for it to dry a bit and... Oh, well. That's... Them's the brakes. Like, I could go over there and just throw my bike over and then just, like, jump in the river and fall. and That'd be fun, but... <sighs> Looks like they got some... Constr oh, they got mad construction going on there. I'd be riding right next to that thing. That's interesting. Huh. Alright, well... Well, uh... I'm gonna uh, head back where I came from, kind of. Um, there's a there's a section there where I kind of hang a left and then ride up back to the city, and uh, that's kind of boring. So uh, yeah, I'm just gonna get off this island and then basically head back up. So with that, you know, uh, we'll catch you on another time for another raw ride.